Most of us have spent almost a year inside our houses working from home. Many have turned to be amateur chefs, only oblivious of the fact how harmful the cook stoves we use actually are. Household air pollution is also responsible for 4.5% of the total disease burden commonly known as the number of years lost due to ill health. Yet this hardly makes it to the headlines as one of the most important causes of air pollution. However, good news seems to be on the way with a team from IIT Guwahati having recently developed the porous radiant burner cook stove. Embedded with an advanced combustion technology known as porous media combustion, these cook stoves developed by a team led by Professor P Muthu Kumar can accommodate fuels like LPG, biogas and kerosene. The development of the porous radiant burners was initiated in 2006. The prototypes needed for the invention were rigorously tested against the available BIS standards for cook stoves. The currently the whatever the technology we have for the LPG cook stove or you know based on the free flame combustion uh, where you can see the flame on the on top of the burner. So here the uh, the mode of heat transfer from the flame to the vessel is convection. The since the gases are having low you know heat transfer characteristics uh, then you can say the low power modulation so the efficiency of this cook stoves are very low they were in the order of about uh, 60 to 65 percent though um, a few manufacturers claims higher efficiency but if you see uh, their uh, if you test this burner at actual condition you will get the efficiency close to about 65 to maybe about 68 percent besides low thermal efficiency if you see the emission they were very high so the most of the uh, you know the uh, i mean the stoves the i mean the uh, the emission uh, comes out from most of the stoves are i mean higher than the uh, standard prescribed by the world health organization so this is the kind of a motive suppose if you make any device which provides even a slight improvement in uh, in a thermal efficiency and reduction in nox and co so the, if you uh, see the uh, the consumption huge consumption in india so the impact will be huge so coming to the uh, you know this our uh, technology basically this technology works based on the porous medium combustion so basically our burner consists of two layer of porous matrix two la two layer of por por porous matrix this is a, we can call it as a free heating zone which is made up of low cost alumina and the another one is uh, above which we are going to have the you know combustion zone which is made up of uh, the highly uh, conducting and radiating uh, the ceramic matrix made up of silicon carbide so uh, it will be like this so we can have this inside will be the uh, poram uh, uh, free heating zone and over which we can have the you know combustion zone okay this everything is it's made up of low cost material we are not using any metallic compound that is the advantage of our technology so when you try to you know the combust the air fuel mixture what happen the combustion happens exactly uh, combustion happens between the uh, these two inter, you know uh, interface of these two zone since the combustion is happening inside the highly conducting and radiating porous matrix some part of the combustion heat will be transferred back to the free heating zone for free heating the incoming air fuel mixture as a result the incoming air fuel mixture is free heated to maybe at about 150 degrees celsius because of this free heating effect we could get almost 100% combustion then because of the you know you can say the enhanced heat transfer happening inside the porous matrix then we could get better heat transfer rate and uh, then as a result we could have nearly about 30 to 40% uh, you know fuel saving so here the predominant mode of heat transfer from the surface to the vessel is radiation you know radiation uh, you know travels at a speed of light so because of this you know the very rapid heat transfer we could get higher thermal efficiency by minimizing the heat loss Okay. so we have the uh, we have applied this technology for the you know domestic cook stove development we got efficiency up to about 82% which is uh, you can say uh, against the conventional burner efficiency of maybe about 68% whereas for the the this is the one is meant for the commercial cooking application whose power range will be about 5 to 10 kilowatts here we got efficiency close to about 65% if you see the conventional burner of of this size the efficiency is roughly about 45%. The research team plans to commercialize the technology within a year and corroborate with industrial partners to extend the research of these cook stoves in the Indian market. The research team believes that the work will have a global impact on the burner based applications and their multi billion dollar market worldwide.
what about the product components we are using for this technology all are being indigenously uh, produced and manufactured here we are not importing any you know product associated for this burner from outside all are indigenously uh, I mean generated technology so this uh, technology is already transferred to a commercial partner our industrial partner named Mrs. Agni Smooth uh, uh, Energy Private Limited and uh, there will be of course uh, I am happy to you know, make a note here that there will be of course uh, planning to set up a manufacturing facilities here in uh, Northeast so that it can also produ I mean, uh, 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 provide an opportunity for the employment of uh, their Northeastern you know, youths. And since the technology is very simple and uh, it can be of course uh, uh, you know, put up the I mean, manufacturing plant can be put up in any part of of course India without much uh, infrastructure. So coming to the cost of course as I already mentioned so all this uh, I mean uh, the burners are of course made up of with low cost ceramic the cost of this burner can be definitely it will be lower than the commercial you know, whatever the burner available in the market that I will uh, I mean make a assurance and uh, whatever the investment you are making for in case of the the big uh, the uh, industrial burner whatever the investment you are making so that investment can be I mean taken back within six months because if you consider the fuel saving uh, whatever the investment you are making for procuring this burner that can be taken up or recovered within six months whereas in case of the domestic burner it may take maybe six to nine months so uh, within about maximum about nine months so the product will be available to you at free of you know, cost then later on whatever the saving you are getting that going to be the real benefit for you Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to East Mojo. For any queries, put them down in the comments section below and press on the bell icon for notifications.